It's Thursday, March 31st. That means tomorrow is April 1st. So everyone needs to prepare for all the April Fool's tech news. There's no escaping it. We just need to let it happen. Just let it happen. But anyways, on to today's news, which may or may not have April Fool's articles. Last year, we covered a Google engineer's crusade to uncover shoddy USB Type-C cables through Amazon reviews. Now, it seems like Benson Leung has gained a new ally in his fight against crappy cables, and it's Amazon themselves. Amazon has added a new line in its policy for restricted products, and it now includes USB Type-C cable or adapter product that is not compliant with standard specifications issued by USB Implementers Forum Inc. So now it means that we can rest a little more easy when shopping for Type-C cables on Amazon. Speaking of Amazon, remember their Dash buttons that came out last year? You know, the buttons that you press to reorder stuff like paper towels or Gatorade? In celebration of their one year anniversary, Amazon has decided to expand the products from 28 brands to a total of 106. That's 78 new buttons. Some of the new brands include Brita, Doritos, Lysol, Purina, Red Bull, and a whole lot more. These dash buttons are certainly going to make getting groceries a whole lot easier. Acer has unveiled a new projector that's geared toward gamers. It's the new Acer Predator Z580. Acer claims it's the first first ultra-wide HD laser projector designed for gaming, and it has a brightness of up to 3,000 lumens and a 100,000 to 1 contrast ratio. The resolution is 1920 by 720, so a 24 by 9 ratio. It can project up to a 120 inch screen from less than 18.5 inches away. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Put your wallets away. The Predator Z580 is $5,000. It's time for... Snappy Snippets. Not even a little bit creepy, no? Just stick with the puppy dog ones. <laughs> Thanks for your submissions. Send us your versions of Snippy Snippets for a chance to get featured. Square Enix might be bringing Final Fantasy XV to PC sometime after the console versions are launched. MSI got an early start for April Fools today and launched their new fake modular motherboard, The One. And then they emailed out saying it's an April Fools joke. Chill. Phil Spencer mentioned at Build 2016 that Halo 5 may not be coming to the PC. Seagate launched their new Innovate 8TB external hard drive priced at $350, which will be out in April. UC Irvine will be the first public state-run school to officially support esports with a League of Legends scholarship. And the Tesla Model 3 will be unveiled tonight during a live event at 8.30pm Pacific. Sources for all of today's news stories can be found in the NCX forum post, linked in the description. So earlier this week, I asked what you guys thought BBT meant, and we got some pretty interesting answers, and I don't know if I'm regretting asking, so here are some of them. Be back Thursday, pretty good. Bad brooding teenagers, boiled beard tilapia, and then there's a whole bunch that I can't read out loud, and Jack thought it was Big Booty Tony. <laughs> okay, so BBT means bubble tea. And I don't know how many of you out there actually use bubble tea because I think it's called boba in California or in the States. But boba is atrocious and it should never be called boba ever. It's bubble tea. And if you don't know what bubble tea is, you should go try it. Here's a picture. I didn't have time to go buy some, but here's a picture. This is Delicious. The most awkward call out for Twitter we've had. I'm not awkward, Jack. This week is NCIX's Springtime to Upgrade sales event. The Canadian deal is the Logitech G810 Orion Spectrum keyboard for $175. That's a savings of $25. The American deal is the Corsair RM750X 750 watt power supply for $114. That's a savings of over $50. Click here for the Canadian deal, click here for the American deal, and below for the rest of the items on sale this week. All right, that's it for Netlink Daily. Thanks so much for watching. Click over here for previous videos. Check us out on Twitter over here. But as always, don't forget to like the video, comment for fans with benefits, and subscribe for more videos like this from NCIX. Now, 
If you'll excuse me, we have to go do some of the April Fool stuff we planned. So yeah, you'll be seeing that. See ya! <laughs>